amazing parents, faculty, guests, and students. My name is Mary Beck Thornton, and I'm the president of the senior class. It has been an honor to serve as president of the class of 2023. I would like to to this year's commencement ceremony, and thank you for joining us as we celebrate the class of 2023. Please stand for the pledge. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. You may be seated. I am May Beth Youngblood, Social Chairperson of the Deschler High School Student Council. It is my pleasure to introduce to you our Superintendent and those who serve on the Tuscumbia Board of Education. Superintendent, Mr. Russ Tate. Tuscumbia Board of Education President, Ms. Stephanie Smith. Vice President, Dr. Troy Youngblood. Members, Mr. Steve Finch, Mr. Ben Wilson, and Mr. Buddy Whitlock. We would like to thank Mayor William Foster, the, city, the Tuscumbia City Council, and all other local city officials and businesses for just supporting the Tuscumbia City School System. Good evening. On behalf of the Tuscumbia City Schools Board of Education, I would like to congratulate you, the class of 2023, on your graduation day. To all the parents, grandparents, and family members, I want to say thank you for allowing us to be a part of your child's life. Without you working alongside us, these potential graduates would not be the young people that they have become. You are all to be commended. I know tonight is something that you have looked forward to for many years, but tonight is your last night as a student of Desher High School. From now and forevermore, you will be known as a graduate of Desher High School. There have been many others, including those that are here to celebrate you tonight, that have walked in your same shoes. Tonight is the night you make them most proud. As with every graduation, this time of year brings both excitement and apprehension for you and your loved ones. The excitement that comes with graduation and accomplishing a goal is to be expected. The apprehension of what comes next is also to be expected. No one knows what tomorrow brings, but you are tested and approved. You have faced many obstacles and overcame each obstacle to become the person that you are right now. And you are all better because of the trials. Bill Gates says, we always overestimate the change that will occur in the next two years and underestimate the change that will occur in the next 10. Don't let yourself be lulled into inaction. You are now about to begin your journey into college or the workforce, and you can be the next leader and agent of change for not only this community, but the state, nation, and the world. You have the ability to affect change through your education and your work ethic. I challenge you to go and be the great person that we all see inside of you. 10 years ago, you were all in elementary school, learning to read, making friends, and having field days. 10 years passes quickly. Time passes quickly. It is what you put into those years that matter. I cannot wait to see what you will become in 10 years. You all have the ability to be anything you choose, so choose wisely but always choose your heart and your passion. If you do, you will find happiness and success. Tuscumbia City Schools is proud of you and all of your accomplishments. We wish you all the best as you begin your next journey. Mr. Tate, members of the Tuscumbia Schools Board of Education, parents, families, friends, and honored guests. Thank you for being here to take part in our commencement exercises for the class of 2023 of Deschler High School. Class of 2023, 
As I reflect over your senior year, there are many moments that each of you have stood out like stars in the sky. As the principal of Deschler, I've had a front row seat to this spectacular year. Each and every student sitting before me has been involved in making this senior year memorable. As a class, you've excelled in many ways. The athletics department had multiple teams who made postseason appearances in playoff games throughout the year. The fine arts departments competed with various ensembles and you earned superior ratings and placed top in the state. Others of you were part of the career technical student organizations as officers or competed and placed in state competitions. These are just a few examples of how you as a class have proven nothing is beyond your reach. As the class of 2023, you were offered over $2.1 million in scholarships and you have accepted athletic and academic scholarships totaling $1,380,530. Those sitting around you will attend colleges and universities, begin apprenticeships, and enter the workforce across the nation from Alaska all the way to here in Alabama. This is all possible because of your academic efforts throughout high school that include dual enrollment, and advanced placement classes. Your light has also shone brightly as you've served your friends, classmates, and community. Through various service organizations and projects, you've been an active part of our community, shown kindness to others, and given back to those who have invested in you. Your friendships with one another and your camaraderie amongst you really make the class of 2023 special. Throughout this year, each of you have shined in your own way. Remember, a star shines from the inside out. As you take your next steps and encounter challenges, reflect on the words of Maya Angelou. Nothing can dim the light that shines from within. I challenge each of you to stay true to who you are and be a light to others as you take your next steps in this journey we call life. Continue to shine bright. Congratulations, class of 2023. Good evening. My name is Mary Beck Thornton, and I am the salutatorian of the Deschler High School class of 2023. I would like to begin by thanking all of the people who helped us reach this milestone. Parents, teachers, administration, coaches, family, and friends. Thank you for your guidance, constant support, and selflessness that has led us all to this special day. I would also like to congratulate the class of 2023. We made it. This is a day we have talked about for many years. And today we are here to celebrate our accomplishments and reflect on the memories we have made throughout our time in Tuscumbia City Schools. Our time as Tigers began at GW Trenum, where we anxiously walked into kindergarten. Some of us were excited for new opportunities while some of us cried and begged for our parents to not leave us. However, we soon realized that kindergarten was not so bad after all. We also experienced our first field day at GWT, and we were excited to have a water fight with our class and Miss Oaks. And before we knew it, we were third graders entering Gary Thompson. Our new school brought field day to a new level with baton relay races, egg toss competitions, and the highly competitive tug-of-war competition at the bottom of the hill. Our long-awaited field trip also took place at RET, the trip where we spent the most time away from our families that we ever had, space camp. Our space camp week was filled with living together for five whole days, space missions, and all-you-could-eat food, which most of us considered the best part. Soon, it was time to move to Deschler Middle School, where many of us frantically tried to learn how to work our lockers, and some of us took decorating those lockers very seriously. At DMS, we also experienced new teachers and changing classes. Our seventh grade year, we went to Washington, D.C. In Washington, we were snowed into our hotel, 
And later that day, we had a snowball fight on the Capitol lawn, which is a memory many of us will cherish forever. And we will never forget Coach Willis's magic tricks on the bus. Finally, at the end of eighth grade, we got to visit our next and final destination, Deschler High School. We moved to Deschler High School, where we would spend the next four years together. We were so excited to begin our freshman year. Little did we know that our freshman year would be cut short in March of 2020 due to the worldwide pandemic, COVID-19. We had no idea what the future would hold. Our freshman year ended with lockdowns, quarantine, and having to spend time away from each other. This was a challenging time in our lives that taught us to value our friendships with each other even more. When August of 2021 arrived, I do not think we had ever been more excited to return to DHS, even though school would be very different. We all remember some of our classmates being virtual and some that came to school but were unable to sit close to each other. And we all remember wearing those masks, but we did not care. We were just happy to be together again for our sophomore year. In 2021, during our junior year, things slowly got back to normal. Our junior year, we were challenged academically, but we were also able to have some normalcy in sports, clubs, and school again. There was even a state championship won in girls basketball, and our band brought home a red map. We ended the year by celebrating together at prom. Finally, August of 2022 arrived. We had waited for this moment for 13 years, and it was finally here. We have made so many fond memories throughout our senior year. We started our senior year with the senior sunrise, and we brought it to a close with the senior sunset. We also had a fun time during homecoming week, wearing our togas and decorating our class float each night. And what an amazing year it was for Deschler sports. Volleyball kicked everything off for our senior year with an incredible season that brought an area championship and ended with a final four appearance. The Friday night lights at the CHAP were electric this year. The band, cheerleaders, student section, and fans work together to show what a special community we have. Our 17 senior players led the way to an undefeated regular season and kept going until the quarterfinals of the playoffs. No one was ready for it to end. But our school and community took the same Tiger spirit to the dome where the excitement continued with big wins, thrilling buzzer beaters, and area championships for both girls and boys basketball. The baseball team also provided us with yet another area championship. Then, add in all of the accomplishments of cross country, wrestling, softball, track and field, tennis, band, cheer, and golf. Our classmates have led these teams, and some have been given the opportunity to perform at the next level. I wish I had time to name everyone individually, because it has been an amazing year for Deschler Athletics. Congratulations to you all. Our class has been able to accomplish many things throughout high school. But through all of these accomplishments, our class has also endured much heartache over the past 13 years. As many of our classmates have lost parents and loved ones. However, we have always been there for our classmates when they needed us and stuck together through it all. This class is truly special. The class of 2023 is filled with future doctors, lawyers, engineers, teachers, coaches, welders, electricians, and so much more. A quote that comes to my mind when I think about graduation and our class going their separate ways is by the one and only Winnie the Pooh. How lucky am I to have something that makes saying goodbye so hard? We are all so lucky to have each other. The people sitting together right now will probably never all be in the same place again. As graduation is an exciting time, it is also going to lead to a big change in each of our lives. With all new beginnings comes an ending, and our ending is our time here at Deschler High School. However, the class of 2023 has been outstanding in all of our achievements, so I have faith that we are going to make an impact as we continue to grow and enter this next period of our lives. Let us never forget the place that brought us together to begin with, Deschler High. All hail and go Tigers forever.
today, tomorrow, and forever, it's great to be a Deschler Tiger. I would like to once again welcome everyone to the Deschler High School Class of 2023 Commencement Ceremony. I'm so glad that you could all be here to celebrate with us on this momentous occasion. I must begin with a few thank yous. I firstly want to extend a heartfelt thank you to the entire Tuscumbia City School System. You have given us leadership, education, mentorship, examples to live by, discipline, and the greatest gift of all, love. Thank you to the City of Tuscumbia and its citizens who have poured into us and supported us in so many ways. You have all been so generous with your time and your talents. Thank you to our families who have encouraged, supported, and pushed us to be the best versions of ourselves. Thank you to my classmates for being my family for the last 13 years. And most importantly, I must thank God for each and every one of you. To my classmates, we did it. The day that we've been waiting for has finally arrived. As I look out on the class of 2023, I see a group with varied interests, talents, and dreams. I know that each of us has something special and amazing to offer the world. We have all helped mold each other into the people that we are today, and I'm so thankful for all of you. For 13 years, we have seen each other's faces at school, games, or just out and about. For 13 years, we've been included in each other's stories. But tonight, we close that chapter of our lives and begin to write a new one. It is terrifying to think about the next blank page that's staring us in the face, but I challenge each of you to take that blank page with courage, strength, and of course, with a smile. While we have an idea of what the next chapter will hold, we never know what can happen. So we must rely on God to lead us down our path. Tonight, I have been tasked with talking to you about our future. We are the future educators, healthcare providers, manufacturers, bankers, engineers, managers, coaches, and communicators. The commonality of those is that we are the future leaders of this world. And as we are about to enter the real world, where we should not deny ourselves the initiative to make a change, we must use our age to our advantage and not as a crutch. In order to fulfill my duty to speak to you about our future, I have written you a letter of things I hope and pray for each of you as we leave Deschler High School. To my kind, supportive, and amazing classmates of Deschler High School, I hope you recognize your worth and value no matter the path you take in life. I hope that you will believe in yourself even when others may not. I hope that you will always choose to be kind rather than be cool. I hope that you choose love over hate. I hope that you find meaningful work and know that you make a difference in others' lives. I hope that you will choose optimism over pessimism. I hope that you never lose hope. I hope that you love and you are loved. I hope that you find a passion in life. I hope that you are surrounded by people who care deeply about you. I hope that you invest in your community because in return, your community will invest in you. I hope that you spread your wings and soar. I hope that wherever life may take you, that you'll never forget where you came from. I pray for your health and for your well-being. I pray that you wake up every day grateful. I pray that you have a spirit that is not afraid. I pray for your resilience and failure. I pray for your families. I pray that you pray. I pray that you, that you for those that will lead and those that will be led. And I pray that no matter where we go, whether that be far or near, that we will all be together again someday. I love you all. Thank you for making a difference in my life. I have no doubt in my mind that you will all go and be amazing people who do amazing things. Go Tigers. All hail, with all my love, Theta. Thank you, Mary Beck and Maybeth. At this time, we will have two musical performances by members of the senior class. Mia Pickleton and Keegan Heron will perform followed by Anna Katherine Johnson and Rosie Thompson.
late to the movies and you're mortified your mom's dropping you off at 14 there's just so much you can't do you can't wait to move out someday and call your own shots but don't make her drop you off around the block remember that she's getting older too and don't lose the way that you dance around in your pgs getting ready for school
brightest colors fill my head A million dreams are keeping me At this time, diplomas will be presented to the graduating students of Deschler High School Class of 2023, recognizing the top 10 honor students in rank order first. May Elizabeth Youngwood. Salutatorian and Senior Class President, Mary Beck Thornton. Honor Student, Tuesday Ann Brown. Honor student, Holly Caroline Hill. <laughs> Honor student, Tanley Reed Jeffries. <laughs> Honor student, Anna Lee Hester. Student Kaylin Lael Bradley. <laughs> Honor Student Anna Katherine Johnson. <laughs> Honor Student Ansley Michelle Brennan. student, Rosemary Jewel Thompson. Darius Jamar Anderson. Sarah Danae Armstead. Brooks Daniel Valentine.
Emma Benzato. Isaiah William Beckwith. Jakari Jatavian Blue. Haley Brianna Phoebus. Dylan Mason Blake. Abigail Paige Brooks. Alatin Jermise Brown. Marcus Daniel Ruska. Landon Arley Buckner. Angel Nicole Cottle. Caleb Brighton Chrisman. Jonathan Dakota Cochran. <laughs> Noah Scott Collins. <laughs> Tyler Joe Cook. Jaden LaShawn Crum. <laughs> Thomas Hunter Davis. <laughs> Joseph Anthony Files. Ethan Abraham Foster. Easton Bryant Fuller. Cody Aaron Gardner. Olivia Grace Gaskey. <laughs> Daniel Palmer Gifford. <laughs> Walter Tyvon Goggins. William Dion Good. <laughs> H. 
Haley Nicole Goodlow. Kira McKenzie Grayson. <laughs> Kayla Lachey Hegler. <laughs> Jacoby Lacan Herring. Keegan J. Heron. <laughs> Alan Blake Hill. Brian Christopher Hill. Woo! Emily Grace Hill. <laughs> James Thomas Lee Allen Howard. Clifton Leon Jackson III. <laughs> Keegan Ryan Jackson. Man, my hat gonna fall off after I do so. Devin Thomas Jeffries. <laughs> Aaliyah Nicole Johns. <laughs> Carmen Ray Jones. Passion Savannah Killam. Elijah James Kelly. Miley Gray Kaiser. Matthew Chase Knight. Christian Felix Lendida. Connor Gay 
Paige Blaster. Simeon Michael Malone. Emily Jean Manco. Shylan DeJore McElrath. Darren Tremaine Mead. <laughs> Abigail Lynn Michael. <laughs> David Elisha Middleton. Josiah Deante Mullins. <laughs> Allie Elizabeth Murphy. <laughs> Zoe Elizabeth Myrick. Demarion Dravel Newsom. <laughs> Jalen Amaya Owen. <laughs> Ezekiel Lee Parker. Lydia Lachey Parker. Devin Ray Pennington. Kinley Maddox Pilkington. Mia K. Pilkington. Yeah! Trayvon Armani Polk. Davidson Richards. <laughs> Janasia Maloney Ricks. <laughs> Tyler Tykira Ricks. Miss 
Isaiah Ray Russell. Adrian James Sanders. Yeah! Jamarian O'Neill Sanderson. Kanaja Briantes Sanford. Shanaja Shiantes Sanford. Chloe Aaron Siegel. Ryan James Smart. <laughs> Hannah Lee Smith. <laughs> Preston Hale Soder. Bryson Michael Steeman. <laughs> Lucas Sean Steeman. <laughs> Taylor Paul Stockton. Caitlin Grace Trowbridge. Zachary Anthony Venturi. Tyler Jade Wright. Grayson Scott Wigginton.
Tanaya Frische Williams. Andrew Hayden Wilson. Reese McGill Wilson. Cassius James Winston. Abigail McKenzie Wright. Bradley Seth Wright. Miss Smith, on behalf of Miss Bird, I present to you the candidates for graduation. Congratulations. Candidates, please stand. By the power vested in me on behalf of the Tuscumbia City School Board of Education and the Alabama State Board of Education, I now declare that you, the senior class of 2023, are graduates of Deshla High School. Congratulations and welcome to the alumni family of Deshla High School. You may now move your tassels. Congratulations. 